like, <laughs> The plots they have are beautiful, dog. I'm just trying to get the charger and go home. <laughs> Anybody else heart beating with the sound in the back, bro? You feel it? Hey, feel it! Feel my, feel my heart, son. I apologize for yelling in here. You're like this, my bad, dude. I'm going right now. Loyalty or lust? Will her, will her boyfriend cheat with another woman? UDY loyalty test. What are, what are the predicts? What are the predictions, son? Most of these, they do end up cheating, unfortunately. But sometimes we get a, we get a couple lucky ones, Jack. Yeah? Maybe he won't. Maybe he's loyal. Wow, ninety-four thousand on yes. 40k on yes. I, I know we said it over there, but just like, as much as I don't want to say it, do what you got to do. You yeah. Know, like. Today we're placing Crown's boyfriend to a loyalty test. How are you feeling about everything? I'm a little nervous, but. Having any second thoughts, any regrets? At this point, you no. Know. Our friends Madeline will be testing Sean's loyalty by hitting on him and asking him on a date. Will he remain loyal or will he entertain Madeline's advances? I always hope that they're not down. Like, I'm, I'm sorry. But also, like, we better free our homegirls from their boyfriends, you know? What's good, fun run? To see how he looks like first? Fair point. What's good, Bear? Hey, baby. What's up? Did you get my text from last night? Which one? The Fine, Charles, what's good? My charger up for my friend's house. What about it? Uh, I was just calling to make sure that you got it and you don't forget. Um, did you check like how far her house is? No, let me see. Sean's loyalty test will be taking place in this LA home. Madeline is pretending to live here. Madeline might be able to bamboozle this man, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Madeline might be able to bamboozle this man, bro. But let's see. Let's see, bro. Is he a disciplined man? That's what we want to know. I think my boy's a disciplined man. He's like, I don't care what Madeline's got. I like what I got. Come on, bro. To get him over, Crown asked him to pick up her laptop. Here's my vote. I think he's loyal. I think he's loyal. If he's not, 50 push-ups. Charger that she supposedly left behind. It shouldn't be that far, honestly. Uh, just make sure she told me she'll be home or she'll be free, like between three and five. And actually, I'm going to give you her number. And um, yeah, I'll text you her number after. And then you can, you know, just kind of like facilitate that whole thing with her. Okay, sounds good. Thank you so much. Um, my boss is like right in my ass right now, so I have to go. But I love you, and right. thank you so much. You're welcome. Okay, I love you. Love you too. Oh, just... So... The love you too. That's not a good start. I'm sorry, it's true. If you don't get the I love you too, it's already something there. The love you too, my nigga, what am I? What am I, your mom? Boyfriend, he used to work at... Mm -hmm. um, I had another friend who also worked at... They were co-workers or whatever um and she worked in a different department than him but she would tell me that there was a girl who did work in his department who at first it was just kind of like whatever but then it ended up being like they were really friendly with each other mm. and i don't know as somebody who's in a relationship i just right that raised right. red flags for me right i so, feel that yeah asked him about the relationship what was going on there if there was something at all um he and he nothing. said that they were just friends everything mm. was cool you know um, that so. what does your friend say like they flirt a lot or how does well let me just be honest she's biased because she's on my team so yeah she she really does she, make so it seem you know like she bit, does yeah. yeah she says they flirt all the time they take their lunches together and on their lunch time like hey like are you happy to be eating lunch let me sit down it's like let's go take our lunches together right and then yeah. multiple times like oh. okay one little lunch whatever oh right? but they take like, it if I'm hearing, like, this is a consistent thing, like, y'all yeah. are, what the f is this, you know? Yeah. Crown wanted to test her. Maybe they're just friends, though, dude. He ain't got no other friends at the job. She was the first one to be friends with him, and he's just like, he just wants a good friend. Everybody wants a friend. Thank you for the, to the, for the sub, bang. Like, everybody wants a friend, chat. He might just, that's what I'm saying. He might just be lonely. Everybody at work is annoying. I hate all of these people. They all suck. All they do is complain complain about their home life, complain about they hate the job. But this one friend here, she happens to be a girl. She likes it. We're on the same mindset. We're on the same wave. That's why we talk. You know, we just friends here, dude. Ducky trying too hard. What do you mean? Boyfriend's loyalty. It's a consistent thing. Like, y'all yeah. are, what the f is this, you know? Yeah. Crown wanted to test her boyfriend's loyalty because she's been very suspicious of him talking to or cheating on her with his coworker. Well, technically his now ex coworker. You see, Sean eventually left that job, but he's still hanging out with the old coworker and talking to that girl. They're just he friends. Fired from and I was low-key happy because it was like, okay, now you don't got to deal with the girl. But then I found out, like, he's hanging out with the old co-workers. He's going to bars with them. Oh, wow. All type of like that. And she's there. Is, she, is he inviting you, though, to go And he's out? not inviting me. 
No. Oh, mm-hmm. wow. And you know for oh, a wow. fact that when he goes out and hangs out with the co-workers that she's there? Yeah. Have you met her before? I Not inviting her. me is crazy. Her ever? Like. Yeah, but at the same time, it's like, if I don't know anything for certain, I can't just, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And it's really not. Not inviting me is crazy work. But look, playing a little devil's advocate here. Maybe he just thinks, oh, she wouldn't like them. They like, she probably wouldn't get along with these people. Like the people at work don't really like to bring new people in. And I don't want to be that one guy. We all just kind of do our own thing. You know, like none of us bring our our spouses or our or <coughs> or our you know our significant others is just kind of the vibe, dude. BS. <laughs> this is not BS. It's not reaching. It's just facts. He's loyal. How are you gonna feel when he gets caught? He's not. It's really not her. I'm, I'm not. I don't have an issue with her. For sure. You know, for as much as I know, she don't even know he's in a relationship. Mm. But it's him. Yeah. He needs to understand that you're in a relationship right. and that's just not how you operate, you know? And you said that one of the reasons why you want to trust him and you almost don't want to do this is because he gives you access to his phone. <laughs> he gave me the passcode okay. a long time ago and I, I don't know, I just never, never used it. You've never checked his phone? I've never gone through his phone. I, I, one, I just feel like I don't have to. I shouldn't have to. Yeah, that's fair, that's fair. Like, I feel like if you're so adamant about me checking your phone, like you're so open to it, then you probably deleted the shit you don't want me to find. You know, of oh. course now I Or you like just I loyal. Check the phone, yeah. But yeah. Whatever, we're here. Whatever the outcome is, I'm gonna accept it. I've given him a lot. We've had so many conversations. I've sat him down so many times and just been like, like, just be honest with me, you know? He says he's being honest, but it's just like, there's different stories. I'm getting different stories from different people that just don't add up with what you're saying. And you know, you know how people talk about like, oh, this is my work husband, you know, stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, know, yeah, you know, yeah. You know, yeah. Nah, that's like, the thing, I bro. Know, I don't know, I don't know if that's they're the doing thing. that type of but like, I'm gonna think. just have to be the crazy bitch today because I, I, I gotta know, I, you know? I, like the, I told you, nah, nah, you know where that really gets dirty? The service industry, dude. They don't care if they have a significant significant other at work, at home, bro. They will cheat with some nigga at work. I've seen it too many times. This guy walks up to this girl and she had just told me she had a boyfriend. Like we're, we were all just talking and I was like, yeah, yeah, I'm married. She was like, oh yeah, I have a boyfriend. And then this other guy walks up and he's like, oh, what's that on your finger? Clearly her wedding band. And uh, she goes, nothing. What are you talking about? It's just like a ring that I got, that I bought. I looked at her like, nigga, you just, you want some of his dick that bad? Like, I thought it was gonna end there. But then he goes, oh, I thought it was your, your, uh, your wedding ring or something. I thought you were married. She looks him dead in the eye and says, nah, me married, never, could never be. I just stood there starstruck, nigga. I was like, we just had the, we were, we're, we were both bartenders. I was like, we just had the conversation. Like, we was just, you was just telling me that, what? Yeah, after that, I was like, man, <laughs> man, I can't. Honestly, bitches that are all stressed about guys having friends from work that are women are insecure, but anyone having a work wife or husband are not, lo- nah, not Laurel at all, bro. That's, when was this? I'd say it was two years ago. Like, right? I want to say it was near when I quit my job to go full-time on you. This nigga said 1972. You're banned! I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if they're doing that type of shit, but like, I'm gonna just have to be the crazy bitch today because I, I, I gotta know, I, you know? And by the way, feel free to do whatever, okay? Like, okay. Whatever you feel like will tempt him, how about it? She said do whatever. Oh, shit. <sighs> now, last time she did whatever, she had a nigga butt naked nasty in the room. That was her, right? You don't want that, my nigga. She be licking earlobes, eating assholes, touching prostates. You know what? I'm telling you, she different. I'm fully 50 50. I don't know. I genuinely do not know. A part of me, you know, really trusts him, but we wouldn't be here yeah. if. Some people would say that doing a loyalty test would be like a break of trust as well. At the end of for the day, sure, for sure. This is you should have already broke up if you had to do this. Something that I'm doing for, right? you know, the sake of saving my relationship. I don't want to just let it go or just go cheat, you know, and just go do my own thing just because I'm assuming that's what he's doing. You know, I want to know for sure before I start making different moves. I think she already knows, though. I think she just wants solid. For sure, but she doesn't have solid, solid evidence yet. So that's where you come in. Madeline began communicating with Sean and narrowed down his arrival time. Pointless. It's pointless, though. If you have to bring this all the way here, like if I genuinely feel like there's no trust, even if I don't have proof. Yeah, I just don't think this is working out. I just don't trust you. I can't tell you why I don't trust you, but I just don't. That's it. What do you need all this proof for? Did it control? You come in. Madeline began communicating with Sean and narrowed down his arrival time. We needed to control exactly when he would be coming. That's your call right there, right? Yep, that's me. Yeah, we definitely gotta move that. Yeah, yeah. If anything, we'll just have one of our guys, if you're okay with that, yeah. drive it up the street. After making sure everything and everyone was set up and ready to go, all we had to do was just wait for him to arrive. I'm scared. Scared? <laughs> yeah, I don't know, like, this is crazy. 
crazy. Oh no. UDY catching cheetahs. I always want to have faith in the male species. That's you know? crazy. After waiting for another 30 minutes or so, Sean had finally arrived. Oh yeah, this is him. Hello? Hey, what's up? Uh, I'm outside. Okay, uh, can you come to the door and I'll come grab you? Alright, sounds good. That is cool. Bro, imagine he ain't cheating and then he finds out after that she said this up so he breaks up with her because she doesn't trust him. I mean, yeah, that I could see that happening too. I think they wouldn't post the video if it doesn't get spicy though. No, that's not true. We have, we are UDY loyalty test experts over here, son. There are many episodes where they don't cheat. Not many. There are quite a few episodes where they don't cheat. You'd be surprised. And they still post them, right? They still post them. They're all still good though. Come to the door and I'll come grab you. All right, sounds good. Okay. Set his car. I think I couldn't even see he drives a black car. Madeline makes her way to the front door to greet Sean. She carries a glass of champagne in her hand. Oh, he's coming. Oh, All right, y'all. Game face. The idea is that Madeline's All been right, day drinking, celebrating the release of her new music. So her okay. job is to act a little tipsy. Hey, how are you? Madeline. What was your name again? Sean. Sean. Come on in. Thank you. Okay, here we go. He, we got him over. That's good. It's a good first step. Sorry that took so long. I was Hi. getting more champagne and I'm here with my team right now. This is Sean, guys. He's here to get a charger. Madeline introduces Sean to her supposed team, her music producer Nathan and her manager Kyle. If you guys recall, to narrow down his arrival time, Madeline told Sean that she had a meeting with them that would wrap up by the time that he got there. Congratulations on your new project, on your drop. I'm really excited to see that. I'm gonna send you some more beats tonight too. Oh yeah. I have like two more for like the next project. Let me know yes. what you think of them. I shepped up a little bit. And then I'll call you later with the numbers and how much everything's gonna cost. Okay, sounds so good, guys. They just be finessing, bro. Like, they just be Truman showing niggas, bro. It makes you wonder, like, is my whole life a lie right now? Or some niggas setting me up on reality TV in, like, three days straight, everything's cap? Everything's cap? But critical in getting Sean over at a certain time and also making sure that the rest of this test would be believable. I wish I knew that Crown was sending such a hunk to come over to get this charger. <laughs> I would have gotten ready a little bit more. Thanks. Would you like a drink? I'm good. Thank okay. You. Nice, nice, nice. I be crushing these side rolls, you feel me? I'm not just a decoy out here. He probably thinks I make the best <laughs> beast in the world, bro. All right, cool, whatever, it's fine. He believes it. Uh, I usually don't date drinks, but we're celebrating. We're celebrating. And celebrating. I mean, That's I, a cap. I don't know. That line right there is always cap. I usually don't drink during the day. I usually don't cap. We're celebrating. We're celebrating. And celebrating. I mean, I, I don't know. You could, can you keep a secret? I really want to tie you. I really want to tie you. But you have to keep a secret. Okay. You have to pinky swear. Pinky swear. Okay. I'm one of these. Yes. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. Come here. I'm dropping my first single on my flex on B B tonight. And it's R B. Really cool. Yeah. Nice. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Cheers. I'm literally like so excited about this. I can, I can tell. <laughs> Would right. you be down to hear a song? No, I'm good. I'm trying to get this shit and get up you out of here. What? Actually, no. You hear a song. You tell me what you think, because I would love to have your opinion, and then... She's a good actor? No, no, she is. It's like that. It's like that. <laughs> I need some extra ears on this, you know? He doesn't know what the fuck she just did? Not at all. But the play there is, once you get somebody to touch you, you instantly get them comfortable. That's a play, son. It's a play. It's a play, bro. My older cousin taught me that when I was, like, 14. If you can find a way to meet hands with them, meet any body part without making it awkward, you instantly make the person more comfortable. She knows what she's doing. She's smooth with it, boy. She just bamboozled this nigga. It's like that. I need some extra ears on this, you know? I can spare some time. Yay. And it looks like I don't have a choice anyways. <laughs> okay, let me just get some more of this real quick. You sure you don't want to drink? I just got here and I already know bro, so he's not selling bro, he's locked in. Plan would give us access to Sean's phone. Madeline just needed to execute it. Sean's locked in, he's not fucking cheating today. I could just, like, he's just got that type of vibe. Okay, the, oh wait, do you have your phone on you? Yes. Okay, can you leave it there please? Why? Because I don't want you to like be secretly recording and then possibly leak my new song. What do you I'm not gonna leave. I, I'm sorry. I just don't trust you like that. Wow. <laughs> I don't trust you like that. Please, just leave it right here. Seriously? Please. I'm so serious. All right. 
Me just being bam, just being bamboozled one That's step at a time. My wallet, chill. Oh, <laughs> sorry. I'm so sorry. Relax. Honestly, you don't want to know. <laughs> Come on in. Madeline what are we doing? Office, closing the door behind. No, no, she getting a little bit too. She getting a little. No, no, she forcing it now. She forcing it now. She forcing it. She... No. <laughs> Come on in. Madeline takes Sean into the office, closing the door behind her. You can sit here. I have a speaker over here. Okay, let's let them start the music. A seemingly paranoid and tipsy Madeline successfully manages to convince Sean to leave his phone behind so that he wouldn't leak any of her new music. In reality, though, we simply wanted a crown to have access to his phone. These songs, this whole project is based around a love interest. This one's acoustic, though. Ooh, boy! Yeah, let's go. Oh Hold on. On top of seeing if Sean would cheat with Madeline, we also wanted to help crown... That type of melody is the one that I could sing on. That's the one I could sing and make sure they don't do me wrong. They've been trying to say I don't got these bars. But me, I look up, I see the stars. I'll never not be in charge. Let's go, son! American Idol type shit, chat. Cheat with Madeline, we also wanted to help Crown find out what the relationship between Sean and his ex-co-worker was. Her name is Evelyn. Are she and Sean really just friends, or are they something more? I mean, remember, guys, Evelyn was the whole reason why Crown wanted to do this test in the first place. We had to give her some sort of closure. You ready for this? We're live? We're, we're live. You sure about this? Positive about this? Yeah. yeah Once we, we do this, there's no going back. I know. There's no going back. Once we do this. Oh. Thank you for the bitch, Edie. Oh, oh no. Oh my gosh, it died. Okay, I'll put it on my phone. Here. Oh, what if he just got up and walked out? I thought I was gonna. Now, I think many of you would Hold agree on. that we is should that have followed Sean and Evelyn around and found out if they were hooking up. Remember how his phone is, okay? We considered it, but in the end, we didn't want to spend possibly weeks stalking them to hopefully catch them in the act. Next time, we'll send Nathan, though. It'd be better just to kind of catch them in the act of doing that. How do we have two weeks to go? spy on these people don't you have anything better to do with your time i definitely do but i'm invested and just like that we were into sean's phone now we didn't want crown to go through it we simply wanted her to change her name with evelyn's delete both of their message threads and then text sean something with hey babe dot 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 we would then get sean to look at his phone and he would hopefully think that it's evelyn his response the plots they have, chat. The plots they have are beautiful, dog. No, they're beautiful. You gotta get, hey, W's in the chat, dude. Cause they be doing it smooth. Hey, Waffles, thank you for the bits, bro. Hey. That, dot, dot, dot. We would then get Sean to look at his phone and he would hopefully think that it's Evelyn. His response to that- Stealth vision on oh, God. They moving like motherfucking Metal Gear Rising, boy. Like Everything she needs to know think that it's Evelyn. His response to that text would tell Crown everything she needs to know. You don't have to read anything if you don't want to. So, I'm with Evelyn, but he's an Eva. Eva? Eva? He's an Eva. There's no Evelyn. Interesting. He's an Eva. Is there? Check, check. See? Surprisingly, Crown couldn't find an Evelyn in his phone. All she found was an Eva, which could have been short for Evelyn. Eva. Mm. That one's you. Yes. This one's called Gotta Have It. It was like my third favorite. Madeline continues playing more music to buy us more time. They, they talk, like they have full conversations. What the f Let's see, okay, but do you see how some of these, I think he's deleting shit because do you see how like some of these are, get, there's so many gaps. Like he said this yesterday, right? And then the last message oh, is said Thursday. You sent her money? In trying to figure out if this was or wasn't Evelyn, Crown inevitably he sends her money. Relax, relax. It's just like for lunch. Like, oh, I paid for lunch. Let me send you the money back. Let's not pipe it up. Let's not make it anything deeper than it is, dog. Come on, bro. Sure, buddy. No, that's just a fact. We ended up reading. In trying to figure out if this was or wasn't Evelyn, Crown inevitably ended up reading some messages. I didn't want to show them because I wasn't sure if this was even his ex-coworker, but their thread was interesting. There were gaps between messages. To give you guys a visual example, here's a message thread between me and my friend. You notice the gaps between our texts? Our thread looks like this because we hardly text each other. We communicate more through voice messages or just call each other. So Sean and this Eva girl didn't text each other very frequently, or Sean was deleting messages. Or they, what? I Seems think like there's so many gaps. Clearly, they, they be talking. He's deleting. You think so? 
He's deleting all the. That's just a theory. Like it's like he's deleting. And it ain't a good like game theory. They're talking so much. Are you sure this is Evelyn? Evelyn. Oh, I, 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 it's gotta be. I don't blame Cran for assuming the worst. I mean, we're filming a loyalty test after all. The reality though, is that Sean may not be deleting messages. That doesn't mean that he and this girl aren't communicating in some other form though. I'm good, I'm done, I'll see you, I saw enough. So switch Ava's name to my name? Yeah, once you do it, there's literally like no one back. Like he's gonna know yeah. what you did eventually. He's gonna figure it out. Cran was convinced that Eva was short for Evelyn and that Sean was deleting messages, so she moved okay. forward with our plan. Okay. This is a new one. We ain't never had a situation like this before, Chad. Send Sean that text. By the way, shout out to Madeline for holding him there. She actually did drop some new music, guys. That was a part of the test, but not an act. Go check it out and download it now. So this one's actually like, oh yeah, I could tell that she's got a little freak in it. Mm. Everyone gotta have a little you freak in it. <laughs> My heart is pounding. Oh, oh God. You think he's deleting? Yeah. Or you think they could also be like voice chatting or like they're communicating like in some other form, like maybe it's like a phone call or something. So she confirmed she's gonna fuck up the relationship even if he's loyal. She's committed. She's at the point where she just feels like he's cheating. By the way she's talking, by the way she's moving, by the things she's doing, she doesn't think there's even an ounce of safe of not cheating from him. She's at, I don't even know why she did this test because she's already at the point where she doesn't trust this nigga. The relationship is shaking and I think it's because of her friend. She probably has way too much trust in her friend too. And some friends just be jealous, dude, right? They're like, you got what I don't have. I might want to subconsciously fuck up your shit. Or like they're communicating like in some other form, like maybe it's like a phone call or something or Snapchat or something. And then... I didn't even think about that. <laughs> I should have checked all his maps. <laughs> Uh, a part of me honestly felt bad, guys, because Crown had held off so long in not going through Sean's phone, and our plan low-key made it go through his phone. Now we had her in her head about even more things. Maybe it's gonna turn out to be nothing, though. Maybe Eva isn't even Evelyn. Either way, uh, just the fact that they're, like, texting back and forth. Yeah. I don't know how to feel right now. Oh, we should probably just prepare the I mean, I don't think that's that, that deep. Oh, that's okay. I'm gonna say, hey, babe, um, what you doing tonight? What's Maybe you... not the tonight, because Madeline's about to ask oh, him. Oh, like, yeah. So, hey, babe, what you doing? So he might get suspicious. Okay. Don't tell me yet, though. I'll let you know when it's tonight. Just hold on to it, yeah. I swear to God, if he responds something yeah. like... Ideally, he should say... What? what the f oh, babe. Babe, what the f yeah, what is that? text this, or yeah, like, yeah. you got the wrong number, you know, like... He better respond, babe, who the f is babe? Something along those lines, right? <laughs> You still playing the music, my nigga? I just want to go home. I want to get the charge. He's probably sitting there in his head like, nigga, I'm just trying to get the charger and go home. <laughs> like, I don't want to hear your whole fucking EP, bro. I just want to get this fucking charger and get the fuck up out of here, bro. I didn't, like, I didn't ask for this. Really? Yeah. You're just saying that. Oh, well, like, you're I, just saying that because you want your charger back. Oh, you're actually really talented. Uh, I will listen to that. Yeah, he said he's a fan. Eight, 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 eight. Winning hearts, winning souls. Eight, eight, eight. eight. <laughs> <laughs> I was only supposed to show you one song. It's okay. Uh, I mean, I gotta get you out of here. <laughs> Let me get that charger for you. Okay, prepare to send the message. He's gonna grab his phone right now. Uh, I think it's in the living room though, or kitchen. Oh. Maybe we go check to see if it's over here. Oh. Thank you so much though for taking the time. I know you're probably busy. Do you have any plans later? Um, no plans. <laughs> oh, wait a minute, hold on. Go for it, hold on. We're not in here. I just want to make sure you're not. Oh. Oh. Okay, I think you go. This is your phone. Yeah, this is your phone. You got a text from Ava. Check your schedule too, but I have to use the restroom. So give me a second. I'll be back. Oh, yeah, perfect. Okay. And so with that, okay. our plan was done. All right, Crown now let's see what happens in the text, chat. Sure that he saw it. And now all we had to do was wait for his response. Is he texting? There's no doubt about He's it. He's confused. Saw the text. Look, he's sitting there like. Yeah, he's a loyal man. He's sitting there like, babe, fuck you mean, babe, nigga. Come on, Sean. Lock in, my boy. The question was, what would he reply? Okay, I'm not going to be 
I don't want you all to hear me. I really have to pee though. <laughs> Sean was on his phone, but no text was coming. He's confused, dog. He's like, babe. No, he's just looking at it like. You think he's catching on? Mm, he could. At the same time, like, I don't This man really went radio silent on us. Like, he's on his freaking phone. Madeline pointed out the message. He saw it. He read it. But he's also confused, like, wait, why is my text thread different? You know, he was like, wait, that's not the last messages I sent. Why Why is it starting off a whole new text thread? If he is cheating, at least she didn't get cheated on with a seventh grader. This happened to me, but one. <laughs> like, what they grown ass people? Madeline pointed out the message. He saw it. He read it. You got me thinking about family. It's <laughs> probably on social media or something. He's seriously not texting him. He's not texting back. He's seriously not. He's on his phone. Like the text thread is confusing. He's on his phone. He's not. He's like, I know you saw that. Come on, Sean, give us something. Even if it's an emoji or a confused question mark. He's probably thinking like, what happened to my last thread? Between you and this other girl's relationship. Prove us wrong about you. Now is your chance. Okay, I'm really gonna go pee though, guys, because I gotta go. I really thought he was going to text back. The only reason I can think of him not responding is that he's suspicious of it because there's no other messages. Yeah. Hopefully he thinks that he deleted the thread. Yeah, bro. He's probably looking at it like... Sure. I didn't think about that. That line is pink. So maybe he's what? like suspicious about that, but... Man, I really thought we were going places with this plan, but unfortunately not. Sean didn't text back a... Bro is stressed. Why is he looking at it? Bro is stressed on his phone. <laughs> this nigga is stressed. Needed three to five minutes before going back outside. More than enough time to. This nigga keeps looking at it. Man to he's like, what I do I say? Places. I really, really do. Oh my god, I had a, maybe a little bit too much champagne. <laughs> So sorry about that. We may never learn the dynamic between him and this Eva or Evelyn girl. I mean, if they're even the same person, but at least we are going to learn if he would be willing to go on a date with Madeline, which honestly still says a lot. By the way, just so you guys know, this was completely unplanned. The fact that you guys are matching. I know. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, down to the foot. Down to the foot. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Gucci flip flops like on Biggie Papa. Right? Something like that. I'm going to have half a glass more. Gotta keep the party going. So we are. <laughs> so did you get a chance to check your schedule? I'm pretty sure. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm down to like hang out. I, I'll be done like around eight. Maybe we can meet like at nine. Yeah, I mean, what do you wanna do though? You wanna stay here or you wanna go out? Uh, probably uh -huh. just stay here, have some more champagne and we can like chill in the jacuzzi. I, I do, yeah. Sean, <laughs> Sean, Sean. Have, um, a few other songs I could show you. So maybe Sean, I feel like for this, bro, like that's already a fail. That's done. There was Sean. no hesitation. That means this, he's doing this all the time. Sean, and Sean was down to hang out with zero hesitation. Like, say a lot. you didn't even he think twice. Madeline suddenly flirting with him, and he was with it. Maybe this is why he didn't text anything back. Well, I mean, it's none of my business. But who is Eva? Eva, Eva, Eva. Yeah, she's just a friend. She's just checking in to see what I'm, you know, I was up to. Just a friend. Yeah, I mean, it uh, seemed like a friend thing. <laughs> nah, she's playing. She's playing. She's just a friend. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I just don't want to step on any toes, you know? I'm like, obviously, Crown is my friend. Like, yeah. I, when she texted me earlier, she's like, hey, is it okay if my BF comes and picks up my charger? Uh -huh. And, like, to me, I didn't click to me, like, oh, is it boyfriend or best friend? Oh, my yeah. God. She's so about like, oh, oh, my God. This is it. This is it. Is it boyfriend or best friend? This is it. His answer right here is right here, dog. Sean! He's locked in. He's got this, bro. Sean is fumbled, locked out for all the marbles and 190,000 points. To me, I didn't click to me like, oh, is it boyfriend or best friend? You know? So I was like... I mean, we're a thing, I guess. Mm -hmm. Even I guess. A thing. Like, what does what that is mean? a thing? It's complicated. Like, mm. You just said it's complicated. Like situations, talking, dating. You know, it's like we're on, we're off. Oh, okay, so it's one of those. Is that true? Yeah. Is that true? Is that true? So are you? Nah, she's not saying nothing. Is that true? Crown, crown. Are you guys on right now or off right now? Like, would she care if we hung out tonight? 
No, I mean we're just we're just hanging out. Yeah, but what if like something happens? Like... <laughs> I don't know if it happens, it happens. You know what I'm trying to say? Oh wow. How do you take that? I uh, I don't have any words right now. I mean, at the end of the day, like none of my business, and I can care less. You know, I just like. Don't want to step on anyone's toes. No, no, we'll be fine. You know, we're just, we're just hanging out. Yeah. So, I mean, I'm just saying, like, you never know. What's Crown is, Crown is livid. Crown is like, she's not just livid; she's upset. But I think what really set her off is that on, on and off again. It sounds like by the way she reacted, it seems like it was true. Like, and she left that out in the beginning. She left that out. She made it seem like they were in a whole relationship over, like through and through. But have they been on and off the whole time? And when they're off, then he's talking to his coworker. But then when they're on, it's over. Cause that changes everything. I mean, I'm just saying, like, you never know what's gonna happen. We're gonna be like in the hot tub. It's like, if we're gonna be drinking, I'm not gonna let you drive home, you know? Like, you're obviously more than welcome to stay. Oh, my boy said, okay. look, so however it goes, it goes, it goes. Let that. the dice roll, my nigga. He knows, he knows he's wrong. Like, mm -hmm. My nigga said, let the dice roll. Yeah. Yeah. Didn't even say it. If it was my girl saying some shit like that, bro, oh my God. We going to jail. I mean, I'm going straight to jail. It would be over, it would be over. Okay, well, I'll see you later. But let me look for this charger. I know it's in one of these drawers. Sorry I kept you for so long. Uh, it was, you know, good time with the company. I'm glad. Here, finally. <laughs> what you came for. Thank you so much. Of course. Oh, wait. Is that the one with the... Wait, can you see it? Oh, wait. That one's mine. Oh. Man. This is a part of the plan, uh, Jack. Let me... This is a part of the plan. Check the room really quickly. It has to be here Some. You can come with me. Can you help me find it? I this don't want to keep part of the much plan. longer. I'm really sorry. Give me all of this. <laughs> you know, alcohol makes you forgetful. Yeah. Let me check over here. I don't know. Where would it be? Where this nigga's like, see ya! <laughs> 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 this nigga like, oh my god! I'm going right now! This nigga's doing it! Ain't no more 4K than this, boy. Ain't, ain't no more, ain't no 4K than this. It be, where would it be? Look at this nigga. I don't know, where would it be, where would it be? Bro, not even, bro not even watching where he's walking. Look, bro's not even watching where he's walking. Where would it be, where would it be? Look at him. Damn. Crown catches Sean checking Madeline out. This man was not just looking, he was also licking his lips. Maybe it's over here. He was licking his lips. This nigga's a freak. Oh. Hold on, bro. Oh, we found it. I'm so sorry. Oh my gosh, but now that I have you here, really, really quickly, I totally forgot to show you something. My okay. nigga, again? Madeline initially gave Sean the wrong charger so that she could bring him back into the office and show off her merch. With the correct charger now literally in his hands, though, he can leave. There is nothing holding him here anymore. Unless, of course, he wants to be here. Okay, sit down. I'm gonna give you a little fashion show. <laughs> okay, he's got the charger. He can now leave. leave. He doesn't have to stay anymore. Nah, he said, he does not have to He's stay like, anymore. I'm trying to see this cat freak out! So I have two designs. I'm sorry, Jack. I'm, like, I'm like so tuned in. I apologize for yelling in here. You're like, it's my bad, dude. I'm just so locked in. Mo like, like test mock ups. Mock ups. Like, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, I'm going to show you the, my least favorite. So I have this one. Oh. The alcohol is empty. I know. <laughs> Okay, this is this one. Okay. This one be for the boys. 50 push-ups. Ain't nothing happened yet. So I'm Madeline Monet. I know I didn't tell you that earlier. That's my artist name. It's also my real name, which is like really cool. Thank you. Okay, you wanna hold it? Check it out. This one is my favorite. This one's custom made though. Okay. This one also says time is Monet, but it has like a little graphic, like nice. all over. Yeah, it's like a mini dress. It is. Oh. Don't tell me hey, about to put this on. I want my girls to feel bad. You know, like I mean, you listen to my music. It's like, it's sexy, boss, like sensual, lover girl. Hold on. It's pretty Hold good. On. Can I sit? Yeah. Okay. What? She's oh. sitting on his lap. What the? Man, 
this is why we wanted to give Sean the charger before Madeline ultimately sealed the deal. This man had a chance to leave, and even now he has a chance to push her off. Hear me out, Jack. Ducky, you're cooked. Hear me out. There's no more room on the couch. You know what I'm saying? That was like the only spot to sit, and he was just being nice. <laughs> He's just being nice. Like the couch is full. You know what I'm saying? Like this. <laughs> Nigga, why didn't you take the charger and leave? My boy Terry's an entire acre of space on that couch. <laughs> Why didn't he just take the charger and leave, dog? We didn't have to do this. But he doesn't. How do you take this? This is the job of the crew. How would you take it? Hi. So, that's a movie so line right think? there. That's a motherfucking HBO movie line right there. How would you take it? We ain't hearing nothing. <laughs> How would you take it? Hi. So, so what do you think? I like it. Like, you're very creative, you know, in every way. Every way. Uh -huh. Yes, I try. I do try. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I do not cry. No, good. Is it worth the tears? Though you kind of wanted this to happen, low key. No point in continuing this any further. I mean, Sean told Madeline that he and Crown were complicated, that they were on and off. He was down to hang out. He was down for whatevers. And I know Madeline was the one that sat down on his lap, but he could at least say something. Instead, he chooses to put oh, his wow. hand on the waist. That's way too comfortable. Wow. Is he letting her sit on his lap like that? He's enjoying this wow. a bit too much. Oh, he probably thinks they really gonna smash. This is ridiculous. This is the end. I mean, what oh, else would he be thinking right now? He don't know he's on the Truman Show. I don't really have any words right now. Do you see a point in continuing this test to like a? I mean, like, <laughs> like at this point, I feel like I, I don't need anything else. Um, I got like pretty much everything I needed, so I'm like, yeah. It. I don't care. I, I'm over this. Is it hot here? Like, it's the. I'm fine, honestly. You better take off oh, your clothes? Fine. Okay. Well, look how he's looking at her, though. That's okay. crazy. This nigga wanna eat her up like some candy, boy. About everything. Yeah. Still wanted to do that? Yeah, I do. Did you still want to do what we talked about in terms of you going out there without the cameras and kind of like interviewing him to see what reaction he gives you first? Um. And then the cameras come out just so he doesn't like freak out. Yeah. You don't do that. Okay. It's complicated. That shit's so ad. It's complicated. Yeah. You see how, like, much that hit her there, that it's complicated part? I think there's some truth to it, dog. I think she didn't want to admit it, but there's some truth to it, dog. And if there is some truth to it, man, it changes the whole dynamic of the situation because, like, maybe he didn't even really cheat. It's just sad seeing somebody you had so much time with start to move on it is sad though because she's like a. she seems like a nice woman she's a good looking woman and to just see this happen is it's kind of fucked well so tell me about yourself our plan to find out if sean was cheating with his co-worker didn't exactly pan out how we thought it would however we did find out that sean was willing to trade his girlfriend for another girl which like i said says a lot i hope you guys have your talkies thank first. you Yeet. thank you waffles you guys already know this shit's, shit's gonna, gonna be good. <laughs> Remember, it'll be just you until you call out okay. without the cameras. What are you doing? What? What are you doing? What? What, what are you doing, I, mister? I, I'm not that tipsy, boy. You can't <laughs> have your way with me. Oh, wow. Right, then we are ending this here. I will walk you guys when to come in. Okay, perfect. Madeline? Oh, yeah? It sounds like it. Oh, oh shit. Um, you wanna come out here? Do you wanna come on? Oh god, this nigga's. He's so confused. Yeah. He has no idea what happened. Hey, boo. Come on, I wanted to see y'all. <laughs> yeah. How are you? What's up? Good. Why are you acting I'm weird? Chilling. How are you? <laughs> are you chilling? Why are you over there? I'm like, come here, like. Sit down. Oh, he looks guilty as. Oh, he you don't knows. know how to act. Oh, he's scared. Sit oh, down. Like, shit. What is so. No shit. Anybody else heart beating with it too? Anybody else heart beating with the sound in the back, bro? You feel it? Hey, hey, feel it. Feel my, feel my heart, son. Feel that shit. That, that shit popping, nigga. Damn. 
Damn, boy! Did you feel my shit? What is so? What's up? Can I get you a drink, girl? Please. <laughs> so what's up? What you doing? Like, what's yeah, going on? I just, I just came to get the. Phone. Oh, you got my charger. Yeah. Thank you. He's either really confused or he knows exactly what happened. So for ten minutes, you've been looking all over the house for this, and nothing was going on. She's a little drunk. I don't know what to tell you. She's your friend. Okay. What? Why are you laughing? Why are you laughing? I just, it's your friend. Like, what is all this Look, hostility? Honestly, like, you're I a little like, defensive right I now. Like me. I don't. I don't even understand. Like, I'm literally. I swear what's, to what's, you. What's I'm just trying to understand. I am just understand? trying to understand. You told me to come get your charger. Right. I have it. It's right there, right? It is right here. Exactly. So, so what do we need to talk about? Nothing what happened. Is, she could have brought that mother charger to the, to the door. Oh wow, the gaslighting is crazy. Oh, he knows. He knows why she's there. He knows. Are you serious? Okay. So, quick question. Quick. I'm just curious. Are we together? In your opinion? We're a couple. Not, not wishy washy. Like we are together. We are a couple. Oh shit. I don't know. I'm asking you. You don't gotta do all that smart ass. I just wanna know if if you think we're together. If you see us as a couple. Oh shit. Well, I guess there was no uh, complications. Why are you interrogating me? What's this? You, you told me to come get your charger. I'm here. I'm, I'm interrogating you because you're lying. I'm lying? What do you mean I'm lying? Because you're lying to my face. And you've been lying to my face. I'm, I'm not acting. Are you f***ing me right now? You got me f***ed up. Her acting insecure? Why didn't you leave? Look, I don't got to answer your questions, man. Like, you're tripping. What is all this? I was sitting on your lap for like five minutes. That's how you operate. That's how you do it. I didn't do that. I didn't. <laughs> Yo, I'm Are you serious? I tried to give you like multiple chances to just kind of tell me what the f happened. I told you what. And happened. you told me what the f happened, uh -huh. but it was all a lie. And you know how I Get know it was a lie? You know it's a lie. Because I have a whole entire camera crew watching you. We were watching you the whole time. All right, let's go. Calm let's go. Just because I knew you were lying, you know, I like I really wanted to. No, that's cool. Like, but. Yo, what the yeah, nigga, we caught you, nigga. We caught okay. you, nigga. Also, question, who's, who's Ava? We what caught you, nigga. Your dick's still you? hard and everything. Dick still... Oh, I can see the motherfucking hard, yo. I can see that shit popping out the jeans, boy. What is this? Bro, you did all this? You feel like you did something? What the fuck is this? I don't feel like I did. You did some you like, what the you started from the door, like... I'm freeing my homegirl. First of all... Mm -hmm. You're sabotaging her relationship. That's what you... Am I sabotaging it or did you sabotage it? You were the one with all the compliments and touching me. What you're, what you're saying to me right now is you're not disciplined. You can't. touching my friend's boyfriend. Are you kidding me? Well, you did it. And you really, you are hello. really, you are really sitting here after I Bro, watched. Get that camera out no, of no, 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 no. Listen, no, you've been on camera all day. It don't, it don't matter. You have, you are sitting here. You are sitting here, getting defensive. Are lying. Getting defensive. Wow, nigga, we have you. you. Nigga, we have you in 4K triple HD. Motherfucking Nikon camera, nigga. What do you mean? We got Sony cameras, Nikon cameras, nigga. Webcams. Hell, what do we? What do we mean? Cause you're lying. This entire from the moment you walked up to that. Bro, what the f is this? Can y'all stop? Can so, y'all stop? <laughs> Can y'all stop? No, we're not. I know I voted for this nigga. I know, bro. I feel like he's actually the worst type of person. You can't just trust this nigga in relationships. I, I wouldn't trust this nigga, period, bro. I put my motherfucking money on you, bro. You the worst type of nigga, dog. Damn. No, no, I take my vote back. I take I take my vote back. I'm not stopping, because you're caught. So, so, Sean, so just so you know, this entire thing was just a loyalty test. Like, your girlfriend wanted to find out if you were loyal to her or not. She felt like you were talking to your coworker. She knows about Evelyn, Ava? When, a Evelyn, she knows about your coworker, Evelyn, or something. And she thought that you were obviously cheating on her with Bro, her. Bro, I don't know you, like. None of this was real, basically. Everybody was in you on this, basically. Texting. No, 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 no. No, stop. Don't set this whole up. Because you're so foolish. You got me up. You won't even own up and be like, yeah, I up, bro. What the f is wrong with you? You won't I'm even saying, my nigga. say I f***ed up. Moving like Logan I'm Paul. Playing. I'm not like, it wasn't even real, so I wasn't even gonna cheat. Like, okay. you just me. Nah, bro. You not even gonna Nigga, what? It wasn't even real, so I wasn't even gonna cheat? Nigga, you just found out that it's not real. Like, I'm playing. Bullshit. I'm yeah. not like, it wasn't even real, so I wasn't even gonna cheat. Like, okay. you just me. Nah, bro. You not even gonna cheat? Nah, nah, nah. Now, I'm hearing the accent now. He's Nigerian or he's Ghanaian. The two, I should have. If I had heard his accent before he walked in the door, I would have never voted 
for him. Hand on her butt and he says he wasn't gonna cheat. That's what I'm saying. That is he cheating. What is cheating? What is cheating? What is cheating? I'm sorry. Because if I'm sitting on another nigga lap, how does that feel? What's that? So if, My okay, dick ain't in her. Go, okay, bet. So if I go sit on another nigga's lap, what you about to do? That? Just saying goodbye? Another. Bet. I'm about to go say another goodbye. Another fucking Tuesday. Nigga. Bet. I should throw this in your face, but I ain't gonna do it because I'm a good person. But you got me hella up, bro. Real. Nah, y'all are crazy, bro. <sighs> so if I go sit on another nigga lap. What if she do that shit right here? What's that called? What's up, right? So it's like, I guess we're over already. Do what the f you want. Hell Bro, yeah. Get that f camera out of my face, for real. You don't gotta be here if you don't want it, Sean. You know, we're no, just- No, you don't gotta be here. Get the f I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't. I don't even know why the f you are here. Hey, Take this boy, goddamn stupid yeah, yeah. ass charger, too. I don't give a f the charger. You f the charger. Take all that Yeah, 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 bro. You weird as You're weird as I don't give a about no f all y'all. Nigga got me, oh my God, he got me so f***ed up. Oh my God. I, if he was sincere about it, he was like, okay, you know, like I did f*** up, this happened, this happened. Okay, that's one thing, you know what I mean? But for you to try to make me feel stupid after you did all that like you look stupid. Oh my God, I'm so high. Oh my goodness. <coughs> nah, I feel you. That was a fucking, that was a banger. That was action packed, dude. But hear me out. Nothing really happened. He didn't kiss her. He didn't lick no earlobes. Like all he did was put his hand around her waist. And like he said, I wasn't even gonna cheat because it's all fake anyway. I'm gonna whoop your ass if you don't get on the ground and give me 50. Shut Wait, up, Jesus. Get on the ground right now. Damn, mom. I just wanna say Loki, I shouldn't have to do these pushups. Cause like, nothing happened. I'm just gonna say it again, nothing happened. Honestly, listen, hear me out. I should only have to do 25 for the fact of like, it half happened. She had his hand on her ass. I didn't see that. One, two, three. I, I think that's enough. 188,000 points. Look at this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten. I'm not. I'm not gonna be the one to say it, but yo, low key, y'all cheated.